The thumbnail gallery widget for Elementor is an easy to use tool that lets you easily add a simple image and video gallery to your website, enhancing visual content with minimal effort. Let's get started. Before getting started, make sure you have the Unlimited Elements free version installed and activated on your WordPress website. Then, head over to Unlimited Elements, Widgets, and use the search bar to find Thumbnail Gallery. Hover over it and click Install to add the widget to your site. Next, go to the page you want to edit and drag and drop the Thumbnail Gallery widget from the Widgets pane onto your Elementor canvas. Choose the item source from one of the following gallery, image and video items, Instagram, posts, products, current product gallery, current product variations, or current post meta field. For this tutorial, we'll use the gallery option as our item source. Select the desired images to include in your gallery. Then choose the image title source and image description source as needed. Select an appropriate image size for both the thumbnail and the main image, depending on your layout. In the general settings, choose the position of the thumbnail panel, bottom, top, left, or right. Set the screen width in pixels at which the panel will be hidden. Enable or disable the gallery autoplay option. Set the time interval in milliseconds between image transitions during autoplay. Enable pausing the autoplay when the user hovers over the gallery. Enable or disable the ability to scroll through thumbnails using the mouse wheel. Enable the navigation through gallery items using keyboard controls. This option is only available in the Pro version. Enable looping, allowing navigation to the first gallery item after reaching the last item. This is also a Pro feature. Set how images fit within the gallery container, either Fill or Fit. Select the transition effect between images to either slide or fade. The fade option is only available in the pro version. Set the speed in milliseconds of the transition effect. Enable the swipe gestures for navigating images. Similarly, enable or disable the zoom functionality for the gallery items. The swipe and zoom features are only available in the pro version. Set the maximum zoom ratio as needed. Select the loader style for image loading. Enable this to open the item link on a new page. Enable automatic playback of videos in the gallery. This feature is only available in the Pro version. In the layout options, enable or disable the text panel overlay on images. Enabling the text panel always on will always keep the text panel visible. Enable or disable the display of the title and description within the text panel. Enable or disable navigation bullets for the gallery. Show or hide the navigation arrows on the thumbnail gallery. Similarly, enable or disable the slideshow play button, full screen button, progress indicator, and grid panel handle. In the connected widget settings, enable the connect remote control widgets option if you plan to add remote controls later. This allows the remote widgets to control the thumbnail gallery. In this section, you can also sync the widget to other item-based widgets. Once you've added the content, you can start configuring the widget style settings to match your design needs. Adjust the gallery's width and height, slider background color, border radius, play button and progress indicator alignment, thumbnail image width and height, thumbs panel background, and more to ensure the thumbnail gallery widget seamlessly integrates with your website's design. To finish the layout, let's add a remote arrows widget for easier navigation of the gallery items. Drag and drop the widget onto your Elementor canvas, and it will automatically connect to the thumbnail gallery, making your layout more unique. The widget has its own styling options, and you can configure them according to your design layout. To wrap up the video, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more awesome tutorials. Start using unlimited elements and give your Elementor website superpowers. We can't wait to see you in the next video. Thanks for joining us and see you next time.